Hey, in this video, I'm going to show you how to make this awesome kindling slash wood splitter. So let's get to it. So I cut up a piece of rebar, I got two pieces at one foot, four pieces at eight inches, and then four pieces that will make up the difference to make a square, which is at about a seven and one sixteenth of an inch um, to make up the difference of the rebar. And then I have this little plate here, this is a piece of quarter inch plate from another project that I had just laying around, and it was already cut in a semicircle, which is going to be perfect for the blade. Uh, so I'll sharpen that down once I... Uh, once I get this built. So I'm going to weld a bar onto the bottom of this so it can be attached onto the frame. So this will be the edge. Alright, so I've sharpened the blade. I just used a mini grinder and grind it both sides into a point. So this will be the blade where the wood gets split on it. And now I'm going to weld it in place, put some braces on the whole thing, and uh, it should be done. So I built this whole thing from just one piece of rebar and this one piece of quarter inch plate. So this wood splitter, technically it's more for splitting wood into pe small pieces of kindling, but it's finished. So this whole thing, I made it out of rebar because I had an extra piece laying around from a home project from years ago. I think a piece of rebar like this is only like 10 bucks maybe, if that. I don't even think it's that much. And then this little piece of scrap, quarter inch piece of steel, and that was it. It's ready. Works well. I tried a few, split a few pieces already, and I'm gonna show you real quick how it works. Give it a coat of paint, it's ready to go.
All right, so that made short work of that piece of wood. Uh, I got all this kindling split that there's maybe like two minutes on this. Um, works really well, super happy with it. Super cheap to make, especially since I had all this laying around anyway, the scrap steel. So give it a try if uh, you got a welder and uh, you need to make a kindling splitter instead of buying one. All right, certainly a uh, hell of a lot safer than using a hatchet to, to make kindling. All right guys, I'll have more videos coming up soon. I got a big project on the go, so consider subscribing. Thanks for watching, bye for now.